There's a reason that Timothy Ferris, who's a ridiculously successful entrepreneur, if you've never heard his name, he's the author of The 4-Hour Work Week, and then he had two subsequent 4-Hour type books. On his podcast, he asks almost every person who comes on what their morning routine is. Well, why would he ask a question like that? It's because waking up early is an ordinary practice that regular people use to achieve extraordinary results. It's regular in the sense that it's nothing, you know, grandiose, it's not flashy, but the people who do it are really high achievers in life. They get more done, they're more focused, and they're in better health too. And this is my story, and I'm in the midst of the story. It's not like I'm already there, but I'll share that with you as we go through this course. And as you'll see, as we get kind of midway through the course, I've decided to get really personal with you and actually um, share something with you that I haven't really shared with many other people. And so when we get to that part, of course, you'll understand what I mean. But like me, you too can begin to change your life through this really ordinary practice of just waking up early and having a good routine. It can be an essential component of self-care. Because the reality is that the energy that you put into your own work, your own studies, your family, anything that you do in life, it's all coming out of the reserve that you build up in your own life. And so it's kind of like the old uh, example that people use all the time when you're on an airplane. They say when the oxygen mask falls down, stick it first on yourself, and then you can help others around you. This is the example that I use and that many people use to remind people that they need to love themselves. They need to care for themselves first, self-care. And then that way you have, you know, you have a reserve within yourself. You're then overflowing and then it's easier and it's more natural to help others. And the reality is that um, having a good morning routine gives you that extra energy and that extra focus to then focus well on your studies or your work or your family or whatever you're putting your hands and mind to. So the decision to start waking up early, it's not a decision um, that's just based on bettering yourself, but it's also the residual benefit of then benefiting all those around you and making the world a better place. It's really a decision to be the best version of yourself. And I'm just as guilty as anyone of knowing what I would like my life to be like, having a good picture of how, you know, what kind of dad I want to be, what kind of husband I want to be, what kind of person I want to be, and knowing that I fall short. But in these last year, year and a half, as I've practiced this, and especially in the last six months where I've been the most consistent, these things have more come into reality. My goals are more firmly uh, the steps towards my big goals are more firmly being achieved than they have been before. And I attribute it really all to my morning routine. And you'll understand why as we start to go through uh, the regular practices of waking up early. And I hope by the end of this I can convince you to be an early riser as well.